Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome uh, here for uh, this uh, first uh, live. We are going to talk about uh, 900, uh, the new 900 combo set. Uh, so we're very excited to uh, explain you the project. Um, a part of the, the concept shop team, the designing team, is uh, with uh, us uh, here. So uh, if you don't know, we are based in France, in northern France, uh, in a golf. It's called uh, Inesis uh, Golf uh, Park. It's our uh, design uh, center. Um, so um, a, mem a few members of the, of the team uh, are here today uh, to explain you the, the project. So we have uh, Albert, who is with uh, our 900 um, Collab product manager. We have also uh, Nicola, uh, Pauline, our product engineer, and uh, Kevin as well, who is based uh, in the United States. He's also a product uh, engineer. So we're going to take a few uh, minutes to talk about uh, the, the, the nine of the clubs, and then feel free to ask any question you may have uh, in the comment section, and we're going to answer them all. We have about uh, an hour together, so welcome. And again, we are very excited to uh, to introduce you this uh, new uh, these new uh, clubs. Hello, so, hello everybody. So my name is uh, Albert. So I will try to do my best in my, with my English. I'm not so fluent, but uh, I will do uh, uh, as best as possible. So uh, let me explain the story, uh, how we uh, build, how we have managed and designed these new clubs and show you also uh, all the details. All right, just to start, um, there is three key points, major key points when we build any collections. Firstly, is a sense of inesis. The sense of in this is to be useful for golfers and our planet. When we say planet, it's, we are very concerned about the sustainability uh, and uh, the eco design. And, and um, any new project is uh, we think about how we can do better for our planet. Okay. And the mission of uh, in this is to make golf easier. So making golf easier, what does it mean? For sure, on the items. It's always thinking to say, okay, how we can make the clubs or how we can make our golf bags or any product more easier than before. And second things, it's uh, to be sure that also in the way to purchase it, to purchase it uh, from a website or in our shops, it's to uh, make the thing easily understandable for everybody. Okay. And then the free, uh, the other, uh, the, the, the last things, it's, uh, all our golf club and equipment is uh, designed and uh, built with the level of practice. So it means that we are very concerned about what are suitable for the beginners. And beginners, it's people that we catch from 30, over 30 on the cap. What is suitable for intermediate players, 30 to 15, and what is suitable for uh, advanced player below 15 handicap, OK? so. Like the example uh, you can see on the screen, the beginners are 100, name 100. And just to make a, a short story, but the beginners are looking for forgiveness, make the, buy, the, the ball fly easily. For the um, intermediate players, the power and the forgiveness, it's a key thing. And we are just launched one year back the new 500 clubs. And now let's talk about uh, the 900. So we work with different, uh, we are not alone when we develop or design or, or, or start to work any project. Uh, we make a long press study and we are discussing with many uh, advanced players from uh, top players, professional, uh, uh, scratch people, golfers, and also other uh, golfers in order to catch any details any feedbacks from them to, 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 to start to have the good things. So for the 900 clubs, what are the main benefits is the control. Control, what does it mean? Uh, it's uh, the capacity of the club to be, to keep the same distance short after short in terms of gap in between each clubs. And also control is also uh, the capacity of the clubs to make, uh, to decide the trajectory what, what you want, make a fed, a draw, punch ball or whatever, okay? And getting also the best contact feedback feeling when you when you hit the ball, okay? So in order to make you um, understanding more uh, 
the situation or how we have developed these golf clubs, 900. Um, when, I, when I say the best of each world, what does it mean? In fact, just to put you in the story, uh, imagine you are uh, uh, playing your, 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 your play in the golf course, uh, you are close to the flag with a pitch, a nine or eight iron, you want to make a birdie. So you want to catch to be the closest to the pin. Okay, and then uh, when you hit the ball, the, the, the club, intermediate club, like seven, six, five, the target was to, to catch a green, to make a two putt then and make your par. And then for the uh, more close face club, the four irons, the three, is to catch a distance. Okay, so that means the best of each world. And let me show you now what are the results and what we have decided with the team in terms of design and uh, club golf clubs okay so the pitch the nine and the eight to be precise to catch a green to catch a flag we we have made it full forge iron okay why a full forge iron because you have the feeling the touch and also all the characteristic of a very advanced golf clubs then we move to another uh, constructions Okay, it's the hollow body for the seven, the six, and the five. And then we move to uh, the utility, utility iron, which is also a hollow body. So as you understand, the 900, it's a combo set in order to be able to be very precise on the short clubs, to have the maximum distance and the easiest distance with the more close face, and then with internet to have the capacity to be very in confidence for each shot. So this is a story and how we build. So now let's go more inside uh, all the details. I suggest now to start with a, a short movie uh, made by uh, Charles. It will be uh, translate, you will see, uh, to explain how we have draw and design these 900 clubs. On va repartir de la, de la base du, du 500, c'est-à-dire de la hauteur et la longueur du club. Okay. Un joueur expert, il a besoin de, de quelque chose de, de, de plus compact, de, de moins large, un peu plus haut, quelque chose de bodybuildé. Donc, on va rétrécir la longueur du club, je te prépare là. Et en hauteur, pareil, on va gagner un petit peu. Donc, en fait, si je dessine des points, ici, vous avez l'extrémité du 500, mmh. ici. Et là, vous allez avoir l'extrémité du 900, okay. donc plus compact. Donc ensuite, on va dessiner la forme globale du club, donc toujours le hosel. Ensuite, on va relier les points du hosel jusqu'à la partie la plus haute du club. Par contre, on va garder cet élément identitaire euh, d'Inésis, c'est-à-dire la casse, qui est un élément esthétique pour nous, mais aussi technique. Parce que toute cette masse-là, on va l'enlever, ce qui va faire que le centre de gravité est, il va descendre sur le club et va rendre le club plus facile à jouer. Par contre, pour les joueurs experts, on va moins l'accentuer et un peu plus l'arrondir pour rester dans les, dans les codes d'un club expert. Donc là, on a la forme globale, la forme extérieure du club. Ensuite, on va venir dessiner la top line, c'est-à-dire l'arête sur le haut. Par contre, on va la rendre plus fine pour le poids, mais aussi esthétiquement, parce qu'un joueur expert préfère des, des plus petites top lines. Donc une fois qu'on a fait ça, on va venir dessiner la semelle. Ensuite, ce qu'on va faire, c'est qu'on va venir relier les deux. On va venir relier la top line à l'arête. Et en fait, on va garder des éléments, euh, des, des codes esthétiques qu'on a sur la 500, qu'on a sur notre club Inésis, pour les reconnaître et qu'ils aient la même ADN. Okay. Donc si on regarde, on a quasi la même chose ici et ici. Donc on connaît tout de suite un club Inésis. Ensuite, ce qui est important pour un club, euh, pour un club expert, c'est la répartition des masses. Donc vous avez besoin d'avoir de la masse ici et de la masse ici pour un joueur confirmé parce qu'il va chercher de la tolérance et de la puissance. Alors qu'un joueur expert, il faut le centrer pour gagner en contrôle. Donc, on va mettre du poids, on va mettre du poids sur cette zone-là en gardant le chevron, qui est aussi un élément identitaire des musiques. Okay. 
Et ensuite, on va venir relier cette partie-là à la fin de la cassure qu'on a ici. Et on va tirer. On va tirer tout droit. Donc là, vous avez la, la shape, le, la forme globale du club. On a fait des, on, on, on l'a passé en, en 3D, en trois dimensions, et on s'est rendu compte qu'on était trop lourd, okay. trop lourd de 14 grammes. Et on s'est dit, eh ben, on va gagner du poids sur la partie haute du club pour toujours abaisser le centre de gravité, pour que ce soit plus facile à jouer. Donc on a fait ce qu'on appelle, ce qu'on appelle dans le design, un coup de bouge. C'est-à-dire, vous allez mettre un coup de cuillère. C'est pour ça que vous allez avoir un creux ici. On se rend compte avec ce que tu nous expliques, en fait, le dessin de, de la lame 900, c'est un mix entre les codes stylistiques Inésis et en fait des contraintes techniques par rapport à ce qu'on a envie d'avoir comme type de lame. Une lame, certes, mais malgré tout qu'il soit facile à jouer. Et finalement, on a l'impression que le design s'impose de lui-même. En fait. C'est ça, en fait, le, le design est vraiment, euh, est, il est vraiment en lien avec la fonction. Chaque ligne, euh, chaque ligne a un rôle dans le dessin. Voilà comment nous on a dessiné le, le club expert. Et après, pour passer de, du dessin de cette lame pour l'appliquer aux, aux autres clubs et notamment au club Hollow Body, comment ça se passe Alors, euh, comme j'expliquais tout à l'heure, l'avantage des Hollow Body, c'est qu'il peut dessiner l'intérieur. Ouais. Donc on peut garder le même dessin extérieur ouais. en travaillant la répartition des masses à l'intérieur. Okay. C'est-à-dire que sur des, des clubs, par exemple, Utility, vous allez avoir besoin de, de plus de, de tolérance et de puissance. Donc on va venir plus creuser à cette zone-là. Donc, euh, donc vous allez avoir du poids ici et ici qui va permettre cette tolérance et cette puissance. Mais par contre, vous allez avoir un peu moins de contrôle par rapport aux lames full forge. Génial. Bon ben, écoute, merci Charles pour ces explications. C'est hyper clair. Merci à toi Samuel. So normally you should have understood exactly uh, how we have designed these clubs. Um, so let me now go on all the topics. Um, in in Aesis, we um, there is three hot words who drive any creation or design from the teams. Uh, it's athletic, elegant, and friendly. Okay, friendly is more for the use in order to be more very easy to understand and very uh, perfect on the usage okay for um, now the lines of what we have decided and what uh, charles explained you on the video uh, we have decided to make this golf set like pure lines okay uh, in order to be the more timeless as possible and also why it's pure lines it's also a way It's some characteristic that most of the advanced player is looking for. Uh, you know, the blade, forge blade is something that uh, we all love to see on any shops. Uh, but uh, as you know, also it's not the easiest of clubs to play, especially when you are uh, playing uh, the uh, closer clubs like a four iron or five iron, it's not always easy to catch the sweet spot. So pure lines, it's uh, a way also to be, as I explained, very timeless. We uh, a dream, it's like, uh, If you take back your golf clubs in 10 years or 15 years, you say, wow, they are not so bad, but still not so bad. So a way to be more pure. In terms of finishing, uh, we are on the team people who, who used to work on the, some uh, uh, car, uh, car, uh, car uh, companies. Um, so we have highlights, like what we say, the mirror polishing, the high hand finishes in order to, to uh, to make the lines and the, um, the more beautiful as possible with the light, as you can see uh, on, uh, on, the video, on the slide. Then we use, as you should know, uh, all the miling process to make the grooves. Also, when, we, when the body uh, is uh, getting out of the mold, uh, we use also some CNC uh, miling process to, 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 to make the, 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 the lines the more pure as possible. Um, regarding the, um, this slide, uh, between confidence and precision, it's what I explained on the, 
use I mean a situation when we are discussing with some uh, advanced players it's the evolutive top line the evolutive uh, offset uh, in order to have something to make your game more in confidence when you play any shot okay advanced player when they are playing a, a nine and run it's not a complicated club to play uh, but playing a four iron uh, full blade it's something difficult to play. So that's why we have developed this evolutive top line and offset in order to make your game more easier when you play the most difficult clubs. We use a force technology, uh, force face. In fact, as you understand, the pitching wage, the nine iron and the eight iron is full forge iron. Okay. And then for the all over body, we have used the face it's a two body um, constructions and we use a face in forge and same for the utility the challenge of this project was how we manage easily uh, the, the gap from the eight to the seven irons because it's two different technology uh, from the full frame forge to a, bo a hollow body and uh, it was a, a big challenge for us and for all the constituent teams and we are very confident and proud about. In fact, uh, all the user tests from, um, that we have done was uh, very sensitive have and, and get some very positive feedback on this uh, uh, difference of uh, construction, but something that makes the control perfectly and the distance easy. So uh, this is uh, why we have used the forge. And also the forge iron, it's, uh, we can have the capacity to be very um, narrow when we make for the face of the hollow body. Then uh, regarding the loft, um, because we want to be very transparent and also to be very um, uh, precise on what we do, uh, we have decided to put the loft, to put in laser printing on all clubs. Okay, uh, as you know, if you buy any golf set in the market, it's not always easy to know the exact loft from a set to another one. Uh, it was for us the idea to be the more transparent and to be, in for, especially for an advanced player, to know exactly on this loft, what is the distance that I'm making, okay? And you can see on, on, this, uh, on these pictures how it looks from the pitching wedge 44 to the free iron 19. Albert, we have uh, already a few questions. Cool. So maybe we can uh, uh, take uh, some time to answer them. Uh, uh, Con McGolf uh, is asking us if uh, these clubs can be played by professionals. Um, but yes, in fact, any professional can play any golf, golf clubs. Uh, but uh, when we discuss with some very good players, like uh, Felix Mori, who's playing on the tour, um, he said that he, he will recommend the club for good players. So exactly the use and the, uh, we say in French, the scenario, the use, the scenario of use. I don't know if it's a perfect uh, word in English. Um, and say perfect for the advanced player. For me, I'm talking about like Felix say, I will not use it. Why? I love the, the short club because as you know, they want some perfect feeling and they also play perfectly well the golf. So, they, because they always play on the center of the sweet spot, the sweet spot, sorry. Um, so I think hollow body for the seven, six iron for top professional is not perhaps something that he was, he was looking for. But you have not the same skillful as some other players as uh, some of us, okay? So yes, he can but not sure that you will do we have a thank you we have a a, a complimentary question by uh, my golf way uh, who uh, asks us are the inesis 900 less demanding with a bit, a bit more forgiveness than the advanced irons of other golf brand in the market wow repeat the questions <laughs> uh, the question is are 900 golf clubs less demanding maybe because yeah. of the combo uh, uh concept than uh, than uh, the, um, the similar uh, uh, golf clubs uh, from our competitors. Uh, um, 
you know, when I say um, our missions is to make the golf more easier, uh, also for an advanced player. So that's why when we discuss with some many, many advanced good players, from people from below zero scratch people or people on eight handicap or 12, uh, for sure it's a, it's a big gap. Um, playing a five, or five irons when it's a sensitive shot with a, not a good line, if you have like a, a, a very narrow uh, face, it's not put you in confidence, okay? And that's why we have said, okay, by listening to all these golfers, uh, we say, okay, how, how to make the things more easier? And as you know, the hollow body, it's, it's let's say the new technology that you can see on many good other brands. Pink is using that. Uh, the new uh, uh, TaylorMade is using this, this also, this. Uh, is making way um, so it's uh, something that um, my dream huh, in, in my uh, youth it's if you play you take some other brands golf clubs and you make competitions from the shorter clubs okay on the eight nine pitch because of the forge iron blade you should be we should be on the nine road maybe the most precise like the other okay and then when you go to the seven six iron, I think uh, with the hollow body, we give more forgiveness and easy way to catch the grids, which is what, what we are looking for. And for sure, for uh, the iron, utility iron, like a four or three, like a, we have bullets uh, with a large sole to make, to give you the most confidence when you play. So this is what I feel. So, um, but I suggest you to try it and, and make your, your, your first feeling about that. We are, we are lucky because we are, we are playing the, the, the clubs now since uh, eight months to test and to make many tests and making tests with others. Feedback is very positive. So uh, let's uh, try it. I hope that you can be able to try it. And the baseline of the, this product is uh, the best of uh, all worlds, which is a uh, a summarize of uh, what you uh, what you are saying. Um, maybe we can uh, go uh, continue continue a bit, and then we have more question. Uh, I will okay. ask you that uh, later. Okay, so you can see on this uh, picture that um, the, also the, the challenge was to have because we moved from forge to hollow to have a, a beautiful family product to see that you are not playing different clubs in the same set. So you can have a look of the looking. Um, we also have work uh, on the wedges. Okay, so we have make uh, um, the same design identity for the wedges with my groove and micro grooves uh, to make the most uh, backspin as possible, which is something that you are looking for uh, when you're making uh, some wedges. Um, you can see here that we use also the same design and, and, and colors from the body of the 900 and the wedges in order to have a, a family link and design link uh, as you can see here uh, and so, so here you can have a the full range from the wedges 58 56 52 48 until the three irons so we have selected just one question uh, perhaps uh, answering that um, we have chosen the four uh, loft 48, 52, 56, and 58. Why? Because of the pitching wedge, which is a 44 loft. We, uh, because on uh, the discussion and what we want to do is to have something, to have a good gap in between each club. So um, given the possibility to have four loft difference from the wedge to the 48, then uh, the 52 uh, give you the four uh, loft difference. Then this two way of playing golf and from uh, different uh, players, people, some of them will prefer to keep the 56 to have the four loft difference link. Okay. And some of them would prefer to have more open wedges like the 58. So it's, it's a way then it's, it's uh, how you like to play your wedge. Are you are someone who wants to be very uh, uh, precise on all loft, or you 
are able to make some uh, 52 like a punch balls uh, with a more open with a 58. Then make your choice. Other questions? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, I follow. <laughs> yes, maybe. Sorry. Um, okay, one important thing is um, all these golf clubs set, okay, is uh, available for right handed players and left handed players, like all the range that we have from the 100 to the 500 to the 900. So then, um, I don't know if you have already followed what we have done on the 500, we, we make two sides because we feel that making golf club by gender is something that is not always right. Why? Because you can see some ladies more tall or taller than uh, men and, uh, and either is also, also possible. So we make two sides, size one, size two. Okay, and then we make three different uh, proposal of shaft depending of your swing speed. So for the swing speed, the low swing speed players, okay, so people who play, if they know, if they know the swing speed, but below 70 MPH for seven irons, we have chosen the Recall 460 F2, uh, which is a very light graphite shaft to make the maximum energy. For the medium player, medium swings players, we have selected the Nippon shaft, the 85 GH in regular. Uh, why? Because it's a very light steel iron shaft, which is very easy to, and very um, have a consistent uh, feeling and contact when you play the ball, but very light, it, which is very suitable uh, with, uh, for this kind of players. And then for the high swings players, we have selected also the, the Nippon shaft, but more the, the 1050 GS in stiff um, uh, shaft, uh, which is a shaft of uh, it's 108 grams uh, for shaft, which is for people who have a, a more uh, uh, swing speed higher, so over 82 MPH for seven irons. Albert, we have uh, a question from uh, Tiravi uh, Tanaraset. He says, gorgeous. Uh, I wish uh, I can have uh, with high speed shafts. So maybe maybe a higher swing, higher speed uh, shaft. Uh, why do, do we uh, choose only uh, three uh, shafts? And uh, is there any possibility maybe to have uh, other okay. fitting so, options? So the question is, can we make some fitting with these golf clubs? So actually, no. As I will say no, and I will explain the reason. So um, in fact, we, we are following the same idea of, of what we have done for the 500, okay? The 500, uh, just one year back, uh, there was no 500 golf clubs in, her, in a this range, okay? So it's a new thing, and we cover six profile, two size, three swing speed, okay? Uh, we, and we, so we have followed the same ID by choosing other shafts for the advanced player. Our goal, because we belong to Decathlon, because our job is to make um, in fact, the, the goal is to make the thing not for everybody. Sorry for that. I will love it, but it's not possible for different reasons, but I will explain. is to make some group of people that will recognize and be able to say, okay, it's fit to myself. Then if you are some people who are very like a very high swings player, perhaps this offer of will be not suitable for you. I'm so sorry of that. But just to explain and, and understand why we don't do that. It's for sure, we know that it's something important. But also the reason of the price that we propose is not because that we, because as you should know, we have roughly 30, 35% less expensive than other brands. It's not because uh, we, we are working with the same kind of factory you know, as the other. We, uh, it's not because we uh, purchase much better her head than the other. Uh, no, no, it's also because, as you know, the other major brands are making many marketing, communication, sponsoring, and uh, now it's the master, you can see how they, they, they highlight this club, which is the strategy of this major brand, and I totally agree about that, but it costs, okay? Also, making many choice of a shaft, it's also something that costs a lot. In Decathlon, 
And in this, our goal is to make some very good golf, golf clubs with the best selection of shaft because if you know this shaft, and I will really suggest to try it, they are fantastic for many golfers, not for all golfers. It's a way also to make our price very affordable and uh, aggressive to make people able to purchase this kind of set. Okay? It's, I will say, the brick one. The step one. Now, step two, we are thinking to see how we can perhaps cover and uh, manage uh, this kind of uh, uh, question that you say, oh, I am very tall people, I have another things playing that not fit to what you have uh, proposed, uh, but it's a step two. And uh, in, for the, I cannot give you the exact date that we are able to do it, but right now, all this club is suitable for left-handed, right-handed, two sides, three swing speed, which cover not everybody, but many people. So I really suggest you to try it. Just make your try, and then you will, you will take your decisions. OK? One thing important, um, I say we are concerned about the planet, and uh, so we are very proud about one thing. It's that we have uh, uh, decided uh, two years back, because making some golf clubs take uh, roughly uh, two years, um, hard work on that, we have opened an assembly line in France, okay? Uh, and the goal, and as you probably know, in Decathlon, we also sell a lot of um, bicycles, and uh, this uh, factory is already working for uh, bicycles, so we are taking all the know-how of these guys, we have recruited some specific guys for making our assembly line. So we are working all together to make the 900 golf club assembly line in, line, in, in, in France, very uh, 10 kilometers from here. And it's Pauline from the team and Nicolas who have managed with the factory how to, to organize that since two years. So it's a long term uh, discussion and, um, and, uh, and, uh, and precision because uh, making assembly uh, clubs is something that we need to be very precise. That's why we make like what we see in, in our team, uh, industrial fitting to side free swing speed. Okay. We hope that after starting and uh, if uh, everything is going well, giving more possibility to uh, other players, which not fit to what we have decided. In terms of price, to finish and then we can have other questions. Um, the golf set, uh, the set of iron from the pitching wedge to the 500 will be sell at 60, 690 euro for the six clubs. Whatever the profile, whatever if you are size one, size two, or you are swing, low, swing, low swing speed players or high swing speed players. Uh, the utility iron, so the four iron and the three iron will be sell by unit. Okay, at 140 euros. And for the wages, it's also by unit, uh, four possibilities in two sizes, uh, at 100 euros. Okay, so this is uh, the price point uh, that explain you a little bit uh, when I say we want to provide some very affordable price. This is also uh, the sense of Decathlon uh, to make the sport accessible to everybody. Uh, and we try to do the best on, on this uh, price. Okay. So, um, other yep. questions? Yes, we yes. do. And we have a question for Kevin. Ah, cool. Who is uh, based in the, the US. So, uh, Kevin, uh, the question is uh, Is uh, our uh, hollow body irons filled with any kind of foam or rubber material? Yeah, uh, great question. Thanks, Samuel. Um, quick introduction. Uh, yeah, Kevin Mayu. Um, I have 12 uh, years experience in designing golf uh, equipment and uh, the last four years with the Inezis team. Um, and uh, so for your question, we do have a, um, a urethane filmed polymer inside the hollow body iron. Uh, as you can see from the, uh, the toe view, there's a set screw there and that allows our manufacturers to fill it after we've done the forged face uh, insertion. Um, and uh, we've, si we've seen a lot of, uh, of our competitors in the market, particularly PXG and TaylorMade that use this um, technology. And it, uh, it certainly helps uh, for sound and feel, which any experienced golfer will tell you that is, that is so 
huge to get good feedback on every contact. Um, so, you know, you, you can tell whether or not you've hit it in the core or heel. It's just a really nice, um, a nice way to judge your own impact um, throughout each shot. So uh, we've seen some, uh, some good CG consistencies by being able to fill in all these voids inside the club head as well. Um, and and uh, as, as Albert has mentioned several times um, throughout this uh, presentation, it does make golf easier as a perception of how you get feedback on your, on your shots. Um, particularly, we're able to control CG really nicely as well, um, and that, that plays into the advanced player being able to work the ball, right, be playable. You can draw it or fade it or hit low punch shots or high shots um, because this player doesn't need the center of gravity to help them do that. They can do it with their swing. Uh, again, um, aiding to the fact why this is geared towards the 15 handicap and, and lower player. Um, but yeah, the, the long answer to your question, yes, we have the uh, hollow body irons filled with the European. Thank you, Kevin. Uh, uh, maybe a question about uh, offset is a question we had a, a lot. Uh, what is your opinion about the, the offset we have on this, uh, this uh, combo set? Um, why did we define uh, this amount of uh, offset and why? Yeah, we, we looked at a lot of competitor irons, uh, particularly the Titleist family, um, because I think they're a very good standard to uh, follow and always understand how they're developing their clubs. Um, the uh, the T-Series, uh, we looked at comparing their offset values to what we wanted to do. Um, it is slightly more offset, but um, we felt, again, looking for a 15 and lower handicap, uh, that it's very, very appropriate for this type of player. Another thing you'll notice on the three, four utility, the five, six, seven hollow, and the eight and nine and pitch, they're they're generally in the same offset. Whereas other companies do a progressive offset. Uh, our our idea on this is that you look down at the same relationship between the shaft and the top line for your utility. The same shaft to top line offset for your five, six, seven. And then again for your eight, nine, and then when you get to your pitching wedge and then your wedges, you start to see it less and less. Um, so that was something uh, we feel definitely gives you a little more confidence. You're not looking at something different in that category of your long, mid, and uh, short range irons. Thank you, Kevin. Um, thanks. A question for you, uh, Albert, uh, from my golf way. Uh, the question is, can it be done if the client uh, requires a combo set including 500 long irons and the uh, 900 short irons? You know, a, a big combo between 500 and 900. <laughs> Actually not, because we, we sell um, the golf club set by the golf club set. So uh, we, we cannot propose right now to make it by unit. But if it's something that people want, we can think about. Um, but I feel that why we have made some evolutive and combo set is to cover these things, to make the things very precise on the shorter clubs and very easy to play on the more close face clubs. So normally, if we have done well our job, uh, you should appreciate what we have selected. Um, like personal feeling, I'm playing now the clubs uh, 900 since uh, eight months, what I say. I'm not used to play three irons. For sure, I play four irons, but I will never give up the three irons now from my golf set because it's so easy to play. Uh, so uh, try it. So, you know, by making the assembly in France, which is a step one, we will have more perhaps opportunity. Uh, but it's not finalized, you know, it's a lot of work to make all the component flow mm -hmm. and supply flow. So step one, it's not possible, but uh, more possibility could be open in the future. The goal first is to make these clubs loved by advanced players, which is our, our target. Huh? Uh, as I say, one year in a half back, we are only beginners golf set in our, in our range. So uh, let's do the things step by step. We are very pleased on the 500 because the feedback from user is very good. 4.76 on the set of irons, which is very positive. Uh, we sell much more. 
Um, and uh, so we appreciate. Now let's see for the 900 because, as you know, uh, advanced players are very demanding, which is good. Uh, so let's see if this all what or works uh, with Kevin, uh, Pauline, Nicolas, and all the other of the team. Um, Makes a good job for, for, for you guys who wants to play these kind of uh, clubs. We keep going on uh, the ranch, the golf club ranch. Are we going to work on a, uh, a 900 driver hybrid? Roof? Okay, good questions. We are in processing. Um, for sure, the COVID, um, uh, as you know, make our plan. We make some uh, postponed delay on this development because why? Because we used to go. To be very close to our factory uh, in order to discuss with all the team uh, involved uh, on the development but also we are with all our team makers uh, in in uh, in asia in order to 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 discuss analyze have a good and transparent communication uh, to all of them for sure with the covid we cannot travel so we take a little time and delay on that it's not a big problem so the target is to be able to propose this range in 2022. We will receive the first clubs. Uh, so Kevin will receive the first club directly uh, in US, uh, normally around May. Uh, we also receive a, a set. We will see if the clubs, if we have uh, make, made it well or not. So it's uh, in processing. So now after the test, uh, so as you understand, uh, we receive, we have a think of all the details for these 900 Woods clubs. Then is the result. If the club is good or not. And uh, we hope that for sure. But we need to test it. So let's see. Normally, if we are well rock, you should have this range in 2022. Thank you, Albert. We have a question for uh, Nicolas uh, about uh, availability when. Uh, we are going to be able to test them where and so on. So, okay. Nicola. Yes. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Uh, nice to meet you. I'm Nicola. I'm in charge of the purchasing and supplying uh, the product. Um, so, what we have decided for the 900 uh, range, um, we have selected uh, yeah. about uh, 40 to 50 stores uh, all over uh, Europe. Uh, that will uh, allow you to try the product because we believe that we need to try the product uh, to make sure that you you can choose the good size and obviously the good uh, the good chart. Um, in this, uh, uh, all the stores uh, selected uh, over Europe, um, they will receive what we call a demo pack. <clears throat> so you will have the possibility to try actually all the all the profile uh, to define the, the best one. And then when you uh, find the good profile uh, with your uh, with your store, uh, you will be able to order them online because uh, all the product will be assembled uh, in Lille, uh, and then uh, the factory will send you the product directly to your um, to your house. Um, we have selected this uh, only 40 uh, 40 uh, stores because we believe that it's we, we need to have two very important things in the store. First is the competencies. Um, as an uh, advanced uh, player, you are looking for some good advice to make sure that you make the good decision. So uh, in this store, you will have a very good advice and a very good service, which is important for us. And then uh, all these stores, they are equipped with simulator, so you will be able to try the product in a simulator. So you will have all the data uh, that can guarantee you that you are making the good choice. So uh, definitely, it's uh, it's very important to focus on a very strong store that can help you to choose uh, the best product. Regarding the, the date, um, all the uh, demo pack will be available available in the in these uh, 40 stores uh, mid May, and so mid May you will be able to try the product and order them. For the first delivery, we believe that uh, our factory will be ready uh, beginning of June. So uh, the, 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 the lead time to receive the product is about uh, is going to be about uh, 15 days to, uh, to three weeks for the first batch. And then we are working with the factory to reduce this lead time to make sure that uh, for uh, all the coming orders, you will receive the product within 15 days. Thank you, Nicola. Uh, we don't have the question, but I know that you love talking about grips. <laughs> so maybe you can say a few words about that. 
Yes, uh, so for uh, our 900 range, um, we trust in the grip we already have in the 500 range. So we are going to put exactly the same grip as we have on the 500 range. Uh, for the 900 size one, we will put the Inesis grip uh, size one, and for the 900 uh, size two, we will put the Inesis um, size two grip. The Inesis uh, grip, it's I would say it's a look-alike um, Golf Pride uh, Tour Velvet grip. So it's a very nice looking grip, very, uh, very good looking. Um, if you have a bigger or, or, or you need to have a, a stronger grip, um, uh, we have, you have the possibility to go in uh, the store that, uh, you re that are going to receive the, the, the demo pack and you will have the possibility to change the grip. Uh, if you want, for example, a size three, like it's a mid-size grip, uh, we will be able to, uh, to, um, to give you the possibility to change the grip for free because we believe that uh, it's not because you have uh, bigger ends that you, uh, that you need to pay more. So um, uh, our advice as in his team is to make sure that you can choose the good grip to make sure that the, the club will perfectly match uh, your uh, morphology. And also, if you want to have a better grip, for example, if you want to, to you, are, you are used to play with a half chord or full chord grip, uh, don't hesitate also to ask the store to, uh, to change the grip uh, on your uh, iron set. Uh, they will have the possibility to do that because all the best grip, the best offer of grip, a new decade, uh, uh, a line grip, and uh, all the wind grip will be available uh, available also in uh, in this store. So no big deal regarding the grip. You you will be able to to define and to choose the good one for your uh, 900 uh, range. Thank you, Nicolas. Uh, maybe we're going to show. Uh, yeah. We have a few clubs. We're going to to show them uh, uh, on camera. And a few questions I'm going to to answer. We have a question about. Uh, uh, Influencers, YouTubers, and uh, uh, someone named uh, Avi God, who is a French, uh, French uh, influencer. So, uh, for sure, this is part of our communication communication strategy. As you may know, we we don't uh, uh, have a big uh, communication budget because we want uh, golfers to to pay for for a sponsorship or a big uh, communication and uh, advertising uh, campaign. So we, we try to make uh, influencers and YouTubers uh, test our product and review them and hopefully if they, they like it, uh, spray the word. So uh, I think uh, Avigolf uh, is uh, in the next, very next day is going to test uh, the, this uh, new uh, uh, iron set and we're going to send them also to, uh, to uh, many more influencers uh, uh, around the world. So, so we are going to, to get uh, hopefully lots of uh, reviews. Uh, Albert, if you want uh, to show uh, yes. the, the club on camera. All right. So uh, I can show you, um, for example, the pitch wedge, right? First, firstly, so you have a look. So you see the high polishing and all the light effect that the team has worked on the design. Um, you can see also um, people are concerned about the offset, as explained perfectly, uh, Kevin. So the offset is very narrow. So don't be, don't be, don't have fear about that. If I'm taking for those is a pitching wedge, I can say the seven iron, so full blade, and now going to use the hollow body, so you can have also a look on uh, the clubs. So perfectly aligned in terms of design uh, identity, and you don't see the difference from a eight iron from a seven iron. And if I take with my for example, the four irons, we have a look. For sure, the top line and the offset is a little bit more, but slightly more, in order to give you, as I explained since the beginning, the confidence for any shot, okay? So, I don't know if, if you have a look of that. And then, is it okay, Damien, I think so. And if I'm taking, for example, uh, the wedges, okay? So you have also the wedges, as I will show you, uh, with a narrow head, okay? Um, and it fits also in terms of colors and design identity. As I explained, the body here, it's really similar colors in order to have the link of the family of the golf clubs. And uh, so 
Is it okay? Everything. Uh, don't hesitate uh, to ask questions if you want to see more or more details. We have also a, a question about uh, um, how do you know uh, your your speed, your swing speed when? Ah, okay. Well, good, good, what are the options? Good questions. Um, as Nicolas explained, all the golf clubs by Demopack will be uh, um, linked with some shops who have some competencies and some simulators. So they have some tools to give you the exact swing speed according to your, to your swing. Okay. There is also a possibility, but it's uh, just uh, a question that uh, uh, that fit you. Okay, if you have at 135 meters from the flag, imagine you have some water over you, over the flag, and what is the club that you use? Okay, or if you use an hybrid or five irons, you are more a low swings players. If you use a seven iron or six irons, you are more a medium swing speed players. And if you use an eight iron or a nine iron or less, you are more a, a high swing players. How we, we have decided and how we make the categories, in fact, there is a link with your swing speed and the distance. We have uh, made uh, more than 150 tests of golfers, any swing speed, ladies, men, senior age, young, and then you can make this category. So that's why we, uh, we have built this free swing speed, which we should cover maximum of profile, okay? And then we have developed another thing, but it's not suitable for, it's only it's a test thing, but something very, uh, you can say, innovative things. It's uh, uh, with the VR, okay, virtual uh, reality, we have developed um, a clubs, uh, a narrow club, and you can make some, with an uh, applications, you can make some 10 swings without hitting the balls, and it gives you the swing speed that you make. So it's, we make, uh, we have worked uh, now since two years on this uh, project with some people who are very involved on algorithm and technical things. We are very close to uh, what uh, provide Trackman, as you know, which is a fantastic tool, uh, two or three percent difference. So it's very reasonable, but we are in test on that. Only five shops will have this possibility uh, for this years. Why only five, five shops? Because, as you know, technology, we have to be sure that everything is working perfectly well. Uh, but it's something that uh, when if the test is fully good, we will highlight this thing because it's something that makes your swing speed very easier linked to our uh, mission. Thank you, uh, Albert. We have a question about uh, the wedge and the loft of uh, 48. The question is why not an approach approach wedge instead of uh, uh, a pitching wedge, 48 pitching wedge? Well, it was a decision. So when we, we discuss on the team and on the starting with some players, uh, we know that the approach wedge is coming. And you, you see much more uh, approach wedge on some uh, sets. Um, we have taken the decisions to, uh, to provide you more wages, in fact. Uh, that's why we provide a 48, which is four degrees uh, loft different from the pitching wedge, which is 44, in order to, to have a good gap in between. So it was a decision to take your decision, your own decision, to how you want to play your games. For sure, if you were my best friend, I would recommend you to take, if you take the um, set of irons, 900, I would really suggest to take the 48 and the 52, because the, 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 the link and the loft in between is perfect to, to have the 10 meters or 11 meters according to your swing speed uh, difference to be very uh, able and, and, and precise on this golf games, which is very important, as you know. Then either 56 or 58, as I explained, it depends on how you want to play. So then it's uh, two kind of people. So uh, you certainly know what how you like to play your, your small uh, wedges. So uh, then you take your decisions. Thank you, Albert. Uh, I have a question about uh, the grooves. So uh, maybe uh, Pauline, uh, you can uh, explain us the differences uh, between grooves, uh, depending on the, the type of uh, of the clubs, 
Uh, okay. We have different technologies, right? Yeah, exactly. Hello, so I'm Pauline, product engineer. Uh, so the question is, what is the kind of group we use for the combo? Uh, we use the U group. So U groups, why? Because it is a, a good solution uh, compared to the V groups. And I can say that uh, we use the M groups for the wedges. It is a combination between U groups with some of micro groups. So of course, concerning the groups, you cannot make exactly what we want because we have a lot of faults with the USGA on the RNA works. Great, and uh, maybe we want a, a few words about uh, the materials we used uh, on this, uh, these clubs? Yeah, of course. If you want, I can say uh, some words. Sure. So let's start with the wedges. So concerning the wedges, we use the 8620 stainless steel. So uh, wedges are casted in one pieces. And as you know, the 8620 um, stainless steel can wash. So we make some treatments on this uh, stainless steel. We make plating treatments. It is a nickel bass and chrome basses. And then we can make uh, heat treatments uh, in order to increase the mechanical characteristic of the materials. Concerning so the forge head with the P is 9 over 8. Uh, we use the 1025 stainless steel. So this one is, as Albert already said, a uh, one piece is totally forged. So it's not the same process as the wedges. Uh, so we, we, we wanted to use a material with almost the same properties, the same feeling as we have of the wedges, but it's not the, like the same process. I would like to add that the 1025 stainless steel is um, uh, a stainless steel with a lot of carbon inside. So 0.25% and that, uh, this, um, this content of carbons show his mechanical properties of the clubs. Last but not least, for the hollow irons, so it is a two pieces irons. We have, uh, for the body, we use the stainless steel 17.4 pH, which is a very common uh, stainless steel with a lot of good mechanical properties. And for the face, for the face is forged. So it is uh, a L cup for for people who know that. It is a cup uh, um, very interesting because we can master the thicknesses. And uh, the, the stainless steel is four fifty five. Thank you, Pauline. Thanks a lot. Uh, I don't think we have any more questions, so I don't know if uh, Albert or, or Kevin, you want, we wanted to, to add any more uh, uh, information about uh, this club, uh, feel free. No, um, you know, um, in our mindset in Isis, we want to be the more transparent as possible. So uh, any questions, oh. any other feedback that you will have after to this webinar or Feel free. Uh, yeah. We are open mind and we like to share because we love. We are all passionate of golf. We play golf since long yeah. times. So you can comment uh, uh, below. Uh, we, we we answer uh, all the the, the 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 question you you may have later. For sure, Kevin. Uh, for sure, support us with his know how. Uh, the team here have also no other know how to 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 cover. We have also some teams in in, in Asia too. So feel free. Uh, we are. Um, Totally transparent, as I say. We also open much and more uh, Decathlon Co-Creation. It's a website in which, uh, when we have some other subject, uh, last time uh, Sophie, who is in charge of the textile, have uh, discussed uh, and make some many discussion about uh, the, the golf shoes. We just make a, a round also for the golf bag. So don't hesitate to to be linked in Decathlon Creation. Sorry, sometimes it's too much in French, but we know that it will be more. English version after, in order to share your problems of golf. And our goal are to try to listen, to understand, and try to give you the more, the best option that we can do. Okay, so this is uh, what we try to do uh, every day. And, and uh, uh, you know Decathlon, it's a big company. Uh, in Isis, uh, it's a golf company inside Decathlon. Our goal is to make very attractive price to make sports affordable for everybody 
and for sure make good product because we are very focused on the customer review we are very focused on the quality and because uh, we know that uh, uh, we all love to play uh, if i'm talking clubs to have a good set and uh, so try it try it give you your opinions i know that on the shaft option that we accepted sometimes people say oh yes but i like uh, the other try it you will see that sometimes there is not so many big difference between we test a lot of shafts and finally the selection we have worked with some major brands like nippon shaft as you know japanese factory fantastic shaft ust mamiya fantastic shaft so let's try and you will see uh, the benefits and uh, you and then give us your feedbacks it would be interesting for us one last question before we we, we stop uh, about lie can we change uh, lie and, and love uh, a good question actually question. Uh, no you cannot for one reason for the forge iron pitch nine and it's easy because the, the, the material that uh, pauline has explained it's easy to manage but for the casting on the hollow body um, the, 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 the sense that we have used if you go over one degrees you make some fragility um, and possible damage on so we, we propose no so that's why we have worked with kevin and other the team on the soul to make a versatile soul in order to to be able to to cover maximum of profile it's not all profile but it's maximum of them so Actually, uh, I suggest no, uh, because uh, it will make a risk on the quality of the items. But step one, <laughs> we, we will. Don't worry, we are, uh, we are, uh, we have the big ambitions to to go step by step. Uh, to we listen to your comments. We know that fitting something that is very important. We know that making some specific thing is important. So we are listening and say step by step how we can uh, cover this. Uh, with demand. Thank you, Albert. Well, uh, thank you. Uh, I hope you, you had a good time with us. Uh, we had a very good time and it's always very interesting for us to be able to, uh, to chat with you and answer your question. Uh, so again, if you have uh, any more question, you, uh, you ask them uh, in the, the comment section. And uh, yeah, well, uh, we're very excited about these new products and uh, we hope that you, uh, you will like it. So take care. Uh, enjoy the masters and uh, we we'll see you later. Bye. Bye bye. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. <laughs> bye. -bye. <laughs>